Our natural world is in crisis. Join the conversation today. The thing I'm most excited about is uh, Japan is the center of heat pump development. A heat pump gathers energy from a source like the air or a pond like the water or the dirt, like mm -hmm. a ground source heat pump. One of those three things, it, it pulls heat out of those out of air. Air source heat pumps are the cheapest. In Japan, if you have an air source heat pump, um, their efficiencies are up to 720%. So you use one unit of electricity. If that energy was used in a toaster, that'd be a certain amount of heat. Mm -hmm. you, you can call that electricity heat energy, sort of. You use that electricity to operate the heat pump and it gathers seven units more of heat from the atmosphere and brings it in. Wow. That's radical efficiency. Um, in the United States, our best systems get to four or five units that we bring in. That's the best. And most of them are around three. What are they doing so, over there? What just, uh, you know, is, is the focus the story. Yeah, in okay. 1980, you know, we had a fossil fuel vice president and our president was in favor of nuclear power. That was, you know, it was Reagan was a nuclear advocate. Bush was an oil advocate. And they canceled all the demonstration buildings, mm -hmm. right? And they decided to go heavy on domestic oil development. In Japan, they had no oil to domestically develop. They had coal and they had nuclear power and a very flat grid. And they started investing in all electric technology, like heat pumps, Whereas in the United States in 81, to the degree that we invest in energy efficiency, we did it in furnaces, gas furnaces. Hmm. It was like a two paths taken in the, in the woods kind of thing. Mm -hmm. And the Japanese path of investing it in more and more efficient electric technologies um, is the way to get the most efficiency because there's just so much heat in the air or in the ground or in a body of water. There's just so much there. You can just keep on collecting it more efficiently. Whereas with fossil fuels, it's only as much heat as actually in that tank of gas. You blow it up, you burn it. That's the amount. It's fixed. Yeah. You can get it efficiently, but that's the amount. Building the Future. Green building in the new millennium. Brought to you by Sustainable Homes of the Future. Join in.